Hi there, Zach again with Let's Play Enola. We are underground. We got doors. We got a. Do we have anything in the inventory? We don't have any. We got the metal with a small child. That's going to go on the microwave puzzle, which is what I am choosing to call that. And it's time to start looking through doors. Because clearly nothing bad will happen. What is this? Uh oh. Oh boy. Okay. So that's whoop. So that's that. I don't know how to get out of here. I can just hit open and I guess it's wrong. Days, weeks, hours. What does that mean? I'm assuming at some point I'm gonna get a anniversary or a date or something. Oh wait a minute. Days, weeks, hours. Days, weeks, hours. Okay, days, weeks, hours, days, weeks, hours. So what are these things? I don't know. A fish, an apricot, water, a bird. I don't know what that thing is. All right, that's not helpful. That is not helpful at all. But that is going to tell me how to do that. So we'll figure that out. Oh, what's this? I'm not strong enough to kill a monster with my own hands. But I am good at building things. So I decided to use machines to put them through tests. Maybe I am not strong enough, but I am smart enough. Uh oh. Smarter. <laughs> oh, clever girl. Times, do you clever know what girl. I realized? Tests give monsters hope. Hope that they can get out if they are smart enough. Hope that there's a small chance that they will survive. So, like our boiler room puzzle that we ran into before. Haha. -ha. Cool. So, we've got sort of a saw thing happening here. That's kind of cool. I'm a fan. All right, well done. Well done indeed, game. Let's see what else we got going on here. I'm afraid of falling into complacency with the fact that the game has not thrown anything horrible at me. I mean, okay, yeah, we got that... What the... Can I move this thing? I'm gonna be able to move it, right? Oh, I can move it. I can squeeze through it. Or just move it. Fair enough. Oh, that's blood. So far, blood has, uh, not... Are you good with numbers? Can you guess what's so special about these numbers? This Whoa. test should be easy. Two numbers are missing. One of them goes somewhere in the middle of the sequence, and the other one goes after the number 23. Pick the numbers by pressing the buttons below them. If you solve this, you'll find something you need in the next room. If you don't, you don't. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. So there's two numbers missing. One goes in the middle. One goes... Hello? For a maniac, you have acquired quite a few... Whoa, hey. A divided by B equals death. A divided by A equals life. P. Alright, I'll pick the two numbers. Well, the... One goes after 23. Well, I can see right off the bat that there's... No 24. Right? Oh, it's a sequence! Oh, no. Well, uh, well, okay, here... Okay, there are prime numbers there. Is that the sequence? One goes somewhere in the middle. And the other goes after the 23, which would be 29. What goes in the middle? Seven. Yeah, they're primes. So seven and 29. And 29. Right? Congratulations. Don't feel so good about yourself, though. Oh, this fuck you. I'm gonna feel awesome about myself. And not because of your stupid puzzle. I'm gonna feel awesome about myself because I'm awesome. Now this has me... That I gotta figure... I, that I'm not so sure about. That little puzzly doodad over there. Whoa. Hey! I got another... Another medallion. Go for... Good for me! Got it a medallion. 
It's helpful. <sighs> the music to this game. That's... Mm. In horror games, uh, music and just ambient sound in general is very important. Because it can do one of two things. If you have no ambient sound, and some games have done very well with this, it really sucks you into the atmosphere by feeling you're, like you're actually there. Like there's no artificial sound to put on top of it. If there is music, it can enhance the mood. But it, it's, it's very, you know, you really have to do it right. And this game has done it right every single time. Alright, so P. A divided by B equals death. A divided by A equals life. P equals oh I bet that was just the I bet you that was just P equals prime, and because A can be divided by something, that means it's dead. All right. <laughs> I'm probably one of the only people you'll meet who will figure out a prime number puzzle, and then be confused by the hint. But that's just how I roll, son. All right, so that was here. All right, so now we're moving up. What does that say? Monster. Ugh. Alright, so I've got two medallions so far. And two medallions to go. I just... Hey! Okay. Don't do that, game. That was not... That was very impolite of you. Alright, this time I am going to save. Alright. That was... Whoa. Oh! Oh! Oh, look! Alright, what's that? There's nothing nailed to the wall. Alright, do I have any notes here I can pick up? Alright, we got a... We got a buzzsaw going along over there. I can't open that at all. So, we're gonna duck. Is it gonna get me? No, it's not gonna get me. Alright. There are any doors here I can... Alright, pop them through there real quick. Oh, a note! A note! A note! After the incident with that boy... Speak up a bit. You're being drowned out by the, the whirring saw of death behind me. Uh, it also drove me insane because it reminded me that the life was so close. Oh. Well, there's my safe puzzle. in the corner and get it over. You kept me here for two entire weeks. Days, weeks, hours, right? Alright, well there's part of the answer for the thing before. So I know my day, weeks, hours. 2-14-3-36. Now I just gotta figure out how to actually enter that. And I don't like that there are all these rooms... Actually, you know what? I do. I like that there are these rooms that aren't actually... Um... That they're, they're not actually something with anything in them. I think, that's, I think that works in this case of this game. It works to this game's benefit greatly, in my opinion. Are we away from that thing? We're away from that thing. There's another medallion. Hey! 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 Ho-ho! Oh, I see you, little thing. Don't think, you, don't think you're hiding from me. Uh-uh. Mm -mm. I... Alright, so that's days, weeks, hours. We got one more... Anything in here? Can't actually get in there. Alright. So we got one more medallion to get. I'm willing to bet it's in that thing. But I need another... I need to know how to translate... The... Symbols on that safe... Into whatever the hell... Into those numbers. To a 214-336. Now what's this? Another note! Do you care for her? I mean... Do you really care for her? You don't know what happened to her, but can you guess it? Do you know how it feels to know you can't help the one you love? Do you know how it feels to know no matter what you do, you can't fix her because you can't change the past? Uh-oh. When she told me what happened, I, I don't, went to look for the monsters. I don't like this I person. I wanted revenge. I found one of them, and don't ask me what I did. Well, fine. The worst part. I won't. Was realizing I don't want to know anyway. No matter what I did, I could not fix her. <laughs> I could not change her past. I don't expect uh. you to understand. In a way, I know you will never understand. 
I have to admit, one thing I'm, 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 I'm sort of running into is that everything in here is very... It, it's very cool. Um, everything has a lot of atmosphere to it. Everything is imaginative. Everything is haunting. It is eerie. Everything is good, but I don't... I, I, I'm still really confused as to how it all pieces together. Now, I'm guessing... Oh, wait. Days, weeks, hours. So... Would it be that thing, that thing, wind? So it'd be like, little alien guy, little alien guy, wind. I'm guessing that's going to be it, because there were three numbers. And the other, the, the only things are star, a bird fi a star, bird fish, thing, thing, wind. I'm just going to remember, I'm, I'm going to try to remember all of them, so. Uh, well, sun, I guess. Sun, fi so sun, sun, bird fish, uh, little alien, alien, wind. Sun, bird fish, alien, alien, wind. Fair enough. I don't know if that's actually... I, I, I'm not, enti not entirely sure how that's supposed to go. Oh, another save spot. Save spot tells me something terrible might happen. Not that it has, but it tells me it might. Oh, and I've discovered the lounge. Well, you know what? It's been a rough day. I'll just pour a glass of Lafraug and relax. Sometimes oh. I have weird dreams. I dreamt about a girl and a woman arguing... I then see the woman falling down some stairs. She reaches the bottom, but her body is bent in a very unnatural they way. They mentioned that before! Sometimes, I also dream about three men. Or rather, shadows that look like men. I see a man with a knife on his chest, choking in his own blood. Well, that's what the other and guy said he would do. Naked and covered in blood. Crying. Okay. All right, well, that was some some things and some stuff. Is there something I can grab here? A metal rod. The photograph... Wait, so it must be used... It's worn on the bottom, so it must be used... Well, thank you. The photograph next to it had a message that said, Come find me on the other... Side. Come find me on the other side. <gasps> ah! Ah! Eee! That's my thing! Oh, I can do the thing now! Oh, I'm excited! I can do the thing! Oh, I can't wait to do I'm gonna do the thing! I can't wait to do the thing! I wanna do the thing. Because I've been looking at that for like, fucking forever. Every time I've played this damn game, I've run into that stupid thing, and I've said, Oh man, I can't wait to, to hit the thing where I can lift up the stupid fucking thing and do the thing. Alright. <laughs> I would've put money down that I was going to get so excited, I was gonna run straight into that, and then smack my head on those things. All right, so so we're getting closer to actually etching away at all the locations here because now there are. I mean, I don't know what's what's an ambient location and what is something that I'm supposed to be solving something in. But so far we have been into. I mean, we were in that in that one house. We are about. No, I already did the thing down there, so now we're heading back up. All right. See, this is going... Oh, man, it's going really well. All right, so now we're going to go... Wait. No, 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 no. I do need... I still need to go down here because I still need to grab my... Um, my thing out of that safe. Yes, yes, crying lady. Hello. Relax. You just... You do your thing. Can't open the door. Wait, where did... Wasn't that ah, shit? I don't remember where. Shit. Wonderful. I forget where the damn. <laughs> I forget where the damn safe was. You've got to be kidding me. I can't forget where the safe was. That's just embarrassing. Came in from there, right? Yeah, I came in from there. Is it in here? Ah, oh, shit. I right, might have to cut a little bit of this out. I hope I don't. I'm gonna try... I'm gonna try and find the damn safe again. Is it in here? Nope. Ugh. I don't remember things. Maybe it was in here.
Well, uh, I thought it was one of the rooms in the through the angel door. Wasn't it? Or was it through the or was it through the other door? Was it through that door down the stair? All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to try the door down down the stairs with the stupid little star puzzle thing on it again. Might have been there. And this is when things become hilarious, which happened to me in Black Bay Asylum, and it caused a lot of awkward... Damn it! <laughs> and it caused a lot of awkward, silent moments, because I kind of forgot where I was going at times. But I think I have this one. I'm looking at my recording time, and you know what? We're... Okay, we're, you know what? We're going to pause here, and then I will... When I get back, it will be when I've found the safe. So, I will see you then. Join me and we'll see where things go from here. So, take care.